Hi, I'm Ellie Cohen, CEO of the Climate Center. Before I share some of our exciting progress from this past year, I want to invite you to imagine with me. Imagine a climate safe future for California. Imagine stepping outside your house and breathing clean, smoke-free, fresh air. Imagine the wind and the sun powering your home, your neighborhood, and your city. Imagine that the food you eat nourishes your body and the farm where it came from nourishes the earth. Imagine looking at your children knowing that you are leaving them a more just society than the one you grew up in. That's what we're working for at the Climate Center, a climate safe California for everyone. I know this future probably couldn't feel further from our reality right now. Climate-fueled heat waves, wildfires, and drought are plaguing all of us. But this vision of a better future is still possible, and I invite you to hold on to it. California has the tools and the know-how to lead the way on climate. What we need now is for our elected leaders to step up. This year, thanks to your support, we've made some critical progress. The Climate Center's work influenced Governor Newsom to pursue moving California's climate targets up a full decade to 2035. We catalyzed the first bill in California history with a target of net negative emissions. We secured $200 million to build clean energy microgrids in frontline disadvantaged communities and much more. Our work is beginning to change the conversation in Sacramento about what's possible but we're not done yet. Now is the time to change policies. That's why we're doubling down on our efforts to break the logjam in Sacramento and build political will for bold, equitable climate action. I can't wait to share with you our goals for 2022. But until then, thanks so very much to each of you for your support and your partnership. I hope you're proud of what we've accomplished together in this past year. And I invite you to bring your resolve, imagination, and support to continue creating a climate-safe future for all. Thank you so much.